So radioactivity is a process in which nuclei produce. The experiment that they made for the radioactivity was uranium salt on film plate. Radiation is a penetrating rays and particles emitted by a radioactive source. Radioisotopes are unstable isotopes. Radioactivity discovery dis was disapproved by Dalton's theory of atom being indivisible. Stability depends on ratio of number of protons to number of neutrons and the size of the isotope. A stable nucleus is too many or too few neutrons com uh, compared to protons. The types of radiation are alpha, beta, and gamma. Alpha particles contain two protons and two neutrons and has a double positive charge. So, for example, uranium is number 92 and it has a mass of 238. And you put, okay. So then you would put 4 over 2 and HE plus the 234 over 90 TH. And then, so both the sum of the mass on the left and right side are even. Um, the beta radiation is an electron resulting from the breaking apart of a neutron. And that is what a beta particle is. Okay, so uh, alpha particle. the 4 is makes 230 238 and then you add the 2 to 90 making it 292 so they're both equal um, the beta radiation is so say 14 guys want to move carbon the beta emission and that also makes it stable. The gamma radiation uh. so the gamma radiation is two thirty over ninety Zero over negative one e is always the same. And then half life. Okay. So um, there's also um, we also learned about um, nuclear transform um, transformation and all that stuff. And they say that like the higher number atomic number it is, like the less stable the um, atom is. And um, we learned about half life. So this is an example of like a half life pole problem and like Miss Brown she show us like we should um do like the start and stop stuff. So we start with sixty four kilograms of um what is that? I don't know. Oh right here. Um of the sample and then um and we don't know what our finish is. The number of half life we will have is um, three, since like each of them is thirty years long. So, so as a result, because like half life is 
the amount of time you take, it takes for half of like the amount, the original amount to decay. So we had to divide this by two, three times. So we had to divide this by two and then um, take the, that amount and divide by two again and divide by two until you get, um, and the answer you get is eight milligrams. And that's how you do a half life problem. Just check the answer. Make sure it's right. Yeah. Okay. Say bye. Okay. Bye. What?